I'm going to Walmart to find the new Rage of the Abyss Walmart boxes or whatever you call them. Let's see if we can pull a Mol Molcarmy, Molarky, Molcharmy. That one. I am here at Walmart looking for the new Roto boxes. I know my uh, camera doesn't sound that good because I remembered I got a new phone and I need USB-C and my old adapter doesn't work and I drove all the way here and my other adapter that I have is at home. Yeah, so it's gonna sound a little worse. Sorry about that. I'm also in cinematic mode to make up for it. So uh, it's gonna look great and sound terrible. So let's go find the Roto boxes. Hopefully in the first Walmart. If not, I'm gonna go get my other adapter and the audio will be back to normal. So yeah, good starts in today. what we were looking for. And where are these two? These are always here somehow. Somehow these are still surviving. They're so bad. Dragon Ball? Little Sparking Zero? No, I'm just kidding. Okay, I'm not gonna lie, I'm a little tempted to buy some of these. Tech on Titan, pretty sweet. Some more tins. All oh, the battle editions, those are complete garbage. Speaking of, they're right next to the garbage bill. Kids, who would have thought? Armageddon, anything else? Two player starter set. There's a lot here right now, actually. Bleach has a card game? What? Didn't know that. Top loaders? Probably really expensive, but you know, it is what it is. Looks like we do have a few options, though, so let's grab these. I'm in the card section, but somebody's complaining right now to customer service. Let's see if I can get it. They're in an argument over there. So we got some drama at Walmart going on right now. But if only drama for us, I just dropped a black, is Rage of the Abyss. So pretty fun, pretty fun stuff going on over here. Do you like free money? Wait, what? What's this? Is that 15 free dollars on whatnot? Yes, it is, because if you guys want 15 free dollars on whatnot, anywhere on the platform, whether it be my stream, someone else's stream, Yu-Gi-Oh cards, watches, shoes, whatever you want, you guys can get $15 free credit just by using my link in the description. And you might be wondering what in the world is WhatNot? Well, I don't know how you're wondering that because we've been working with WhatNot for over a year now, but if you are new, WhatNot is an auction platform where you guys can buy, you can sell. If you wanna become a seller, you can use my link as well. And you guys can go on there and start selling your own stuff. But there are tons and tons of different collectibles on there, including Yu-Gi-Oh cards, Pokemon cards, watches, shoes, and pretty much anything else you can think of. So if you guys want 15 free dollars toward any of that stuff from anyone on the platform, make sure you use my link in the description. Oh, and you can also use it on my live stream this Thursday where we will be selling some unique singles such as like glossy print, original, starter deck blue eyes. We have reverse foil, thousand dragon. We've got some really cool, unique stuff coming up this Thursday. I'll also be selling a few extra Pequeno Moth mats. There will be a Starlight Rare mat sold as well. So keep an eye out for that on Thursday. So go bookmark my stream on the WhatNot app. And I want to see you guys there with 15 free dollars in hand. All right, we are back from Walmart. I was able to find a few of these new... I never know what to call these things, like special editions, basically. They do have the tokens inside, so it looks like they do have the tokens like they were doing with the other core sets. With like uh, the Retro Pack 1 and the Light of Destruction, they didn't do that. They were just kind of like, no, we're just putting packs in there. That's all you're getting. So I showed you guys how much we spent. It was around like $95 for these five. So we're going to try and see if we can maybe make our money back on this opening. But first, we have a giveaway. I will be giving away every token card we pull in this video. So there's going to be five because there's five different mini boxes. Just like the video, be subscribed turn on notifications and let me know down below will we make our money back on this opening let's get to it we have five mini boxes to open up let's see what the tokens are looking like they did have a few of these i went to a different walmart this time just to see you know because i hadn't been there in a while what was going on we saw you know a pretty decent selection over there we had uh, the lady that was uh arguing with the management or whatever that was pretty interesting uh, she wasn't buying Yu-Gi-Oh cards though. Uh, uh, so we had free reign. If she was over there, I might have had to leave because it could have gotten crazy. Let's see what this token is. We got Playmaker. Yeah, link into the Vrains. I was about to ask which which one he was from, and then I saw it says so Vrains right there, so I didn't even have to worry about it. So we have the token. All right, we've only got 20 packs to open today, so it's not a super long video. So sit back, relax, and enjoy the video. Go check out your local Walmarts. They are, you know, guys, no, they're more expensive to go to Walmart. So if you do want them a little bit cheaper, you can go to Sassy Auto. Link in the description. Get 5% off using my discount code if you want to buy a booster box. But if you do want the tokens, you are going to have to go to Walmart, or you're going to have to win this giveaway uh, because these are exclusive to the retail packs, which is cool that they have something 
to draw you in, you know, to, to buy the retail pot packs and stuff. So you at least get a little bit of extra out of there. So let's do one, two, three, four from the back. Can we get, we never pulled, look, we did a big opening. We did pull the Heart of the Blue Eyes, which was amazing. We finally got the card we wanted. We didn't get the Mulch Army uh, QCR, so I would be okay with pulling that today. Armored Shark and Rescue Hedgehog. Okay, cool. Let's see if we can get it. I mean, even a Secret Rare is going to be a big win, but the QCR would be massive. That would be like our best retail pull probably ever. I don't even know. What is our best retail pull ever? It's probably... It's hard to say, really. I don't know what it is. Rux and Special, Battle Wasp. So, so far, we're 0 for 3. Not a great start on this first one. I don't think we've ever pulled a Starlight. We have pulled some QCRs before, but I don't think it's ever been a big one that we actually were really looking for. Oh, we got the Butterfly Fish. Chaos, Max Metal Morph. Apparently, they're building a bunch of cards around this. They're doing uh, all the ones from this set. I think Flame Swordsman has one coming up that goes with it. It's like a metal Flame Swordsman. Really, really cool archetype. I'm excited. I've Rux and Special like every pack. And we are 0 for 4. Retail packs, baby. All right. Next token is this guy. This guy's from uh, Zexel, I think, right? I think this guy's from Zexel. Yuma. Yeah, yeah, that's Zexel. I'm pretty sure that's right. I that's, only know that because of Duel Links. I'm not going to lie. Uh, okay, four packs. 0 for 4 so far, but it only takes one pack. It only takes one pack to turn that around. So four from the back. Here we go. If we get any QCR, we're happy. But if we get the big one, we're going to be... Okay, come on, Zoa. Chill out, buddy. All right, six strike. Mimigo Army. Supply Soldier. Azmina. Chaos Lurk Queen. And final bringer of the end times. Speaking of the end times, we are 0 for 5. We're not doing so good right now. Let's see... If we can get something that is not a super rare, ultra rare, secret rare, tactical trainer. What is this guy? He's pretty cool. A warrior tuner. Armor shark. We have the summer schoolwork successful. Yay. Flipping feline and. Oh, yes. There we go. Okay, Deception of the Sinful Spoils. That's like 50 bucks. So money making our money back? Not quite yet, but with the tokens in this, we might get pretty close. So there's the there it is on the screen. That's what we're at. We're like, we were negative $95 plus the, you know, minus the two tokens. Technically, those are being given away, but we're going to count them toward the score, right? For the opening. That's a really great pull. Second best secret rare in the set. I cannot complain about that one. Let's see about number two or number three. Pack number three. From our second box. So far, a great opening. Guild of Sinful Spoils. And Rescue Hedgehog. I will take Rescue Hedgehogs. Those are cool. Last pack. Here we go. Last pack of box number two. We have three left. Still a lot of potential in this opening, guys. I mean, we pulled <laughs> Sinful Spoils already. That's pretty amazing. Uh, Heavy Cavalry. Virtue Stream. We have Phalanop Sisters. Never Ending Nightmare. Primate Hell. Oh, we got an Xyz number C32, Shark Drake. I think if it's an Xyz, I think it's guaranteed super of this. All right, that was a pretty good second box. We've only pulled one non-super rare, and it was a huge one. So I'd rather pull like three total non-super rares and then I'll just be really good than pull a bunch of like, you know, average ones. Very nice. I will take that. Let's get the packs out, get the token out. Let's see what we can do. We have, oh yeah, here we go. You say, I know that one. That is a little Yu-Gi-Oh 5Ds. Let's rub it up. A little Tristan turned into You Say right there. Okay. Rage of the Abyss. Bless us with a little bit more luck because so far it's been a great start. We are not quite to 95 bucks, but we are getting there. Newbie. This set may not be chock full of amazing cards, but just having a card that can basically make your money back right off the bat, or a couple of them, is pretty sweet. Moving Feline. And Azamina, Ila, Sylvia, another super rare. We are one for nine at this point, but the one was a big one. We just pull a Mulch Army. QCR, we'll just go two for 20. I'll be happy with that. Virtue Stream. Ruby Sapphire, the Adamant Jewel. Is that like a Pokemon game? Okay, Denial, we have Magi Mercy, QQ. Reincarnation, Unveiling Mail. XC's Poseidon Splash, Asmina Determination, and Cursed Fire King Doom Burst. So we are one for 10 now. Okay. No, wait. Yeah, that's right. One for 10. One for 10. Off to a uh, ratio slow start, but a pretty decent start overall. We've got the Armed Rebellion. Superu Purin. Phalanop. Mimigo Army. We have the Armored Shark. Guilt of the Sinful Spoil. Oh, this Edgeware looked like a QCR. I thought we got one. It's just Edgeware. Final bringer of the end times. That was a troll right there. I was like, whoa, that's shiny. And it was just Edgeware. So it was actually a negative thing. Last pack. We are one for 11 so far with one amazing card and 11 super rares. Let's see. Release brainwashing. Come on. 
Turn it around right here. Let's let's get a second foil. Let's make it a good one. Spy soldier. Summer school. I see a fusion. That could be an ultra. Yeah, it is an ultra. Okay, our second non-super. Azamina Mu Silago or something. I'm guessing that R is silent, but that's not a huge one. So that's not going to add too much to the opening. Box number four. What will the token be? It is a... Oh, okay. We got a little Jade and Yuki there. We got GX. So we've almost hit all of them. Is it like every protagonist? We have... So we have GX, 5D, Zexel, and uh, Vrains. That's like four of the, there's the original, there's Arc V. That might be all but two, or unless I'm missing one. Maybe like sevens has one. Okay. Two for 12 so far. Let's see if we can get something big right here. Heavy Cavalry, Zoa, Azamina, Summer School Work Successful, never ending. Chaos Alert Queen, Puppa Chart, and Metal Illusionist. Pretty cool card, pretty cool card. But it is just a super rare, so it is not crazy. Next three packs. Will you bless us with something fantastic? Union Pilot. Battle Wasp. Rock Sets Bachelor. Time Engine. Maggi Mercy. Dactyl Train the Six Samurai. Goblin Biker Grand. S Crisis, I should say. Not Grand Squad. And Legendary Lord Six Samurai and Nishi. Another super rare. Okay, come on, Walmart. I believe in you, Walmart. Guys, let me know what you think about uh, Rhoda if you haven't already in another video because we have done a few videos about Rhoda at this point. We did a live stream. Five hours, by the way. Super fun. Thank you guys for coming out. I am streaming up pretty much every other day. There's another Mo Regina. Well, this is a different one, but another Azamina, I should say. I am streaming Thursday for Whatnot. If you guys have not seen that, we had an ad in this video, so you guys should see it. But we are streaming Thursday for Whatnot, doing singles. We should have, we're going to have a couple of Canyon Moth mats available over there. Next week, we're doing a 250K special on Whatnot as well. It's a uh, very special whatnot opening. We're probably, I haven't announced it yet, so I'll wait. I'll wait for that. Still, there's a big giveaway. We're giving away Stardust Dragon Ghost Rare. We have an exclusive whatnot mat coming out as well. And what we're opening, I'm sure you guys might be able to guess, but it's going to be fun. Ruby, Sapphire, we have Anarchist, we have Summer School, Never Ending. A scourge. If we had pulled two of the set, <laughs> that'd have been pretty crazy. All right, last box. We are also uh, we also stream Monday, Wednesday, Friday on Twitch. If you guys don't follow there, Monday is Wheeled Goat, so it's uh, you know building the deck, spinning the wheel, all that different. Sometimes I spin the wheel before and we build the deck and then do testing. And then the other two days, I have been doing some Master Duel on the ladder. So I've been doing a little bit of current Yu-Gi-Oh. It's been fun. You guys uh, maybe aren't into current Yu-Gi-Oh. Don't worry, I'm playing Dark Magician. It's still really fun. So come on over and watch the Twitch stream. And our last one is that you say dupe. That's okay. And four packs left. Okay, so a lot of stuff coming up. You guys aren't following the streams and you guys are like streams. You know, you're stream people. Go check them out. They're super fun. Whatnot especially is going to be really exciting coming up. All right, we have Battle Wasp Wind. Let's go. Newbie. Ruby Sapphire with Tactical Trainer. Puppet Shark. Man Man. Perform a ball, perform age ball bouncer, ball bouncer, man, I cannot speak. The Heos Varg, the mechanical dawn. So far, no mulch armor, you guys. We did pull a bunch of them in the live stream, though. We didn't get the QCR, though, which is kind of the goal. I would like to pull one at some point, but this set is going to be really hard to get because of how expensive the cards are, so we might never get that one. I mean, at least not for a long time. Who knows? Uh, plus, I have other things I need to pull between now and then. Metal Illusionist, we still need to pull Millennium Shield. We still need to pull Judgment Dragon, and you guys obviously know the other one that we have not pulled yet. Two packs left. Make sure you subscribe to the channel if you've enjoyed it. Also, don't forget to check out Ruxin34.com if you guys want to support the channel. I have a lot of old school stuff over there, like 2003 10s. Uh, we have some starter decks that are like in really great shape right, at, right out of the case, so go check those out. Time Engine, we have Purin Purin. Chaos Alert, we have Six Samurai, Armored Shark. Successful, and a Primate Roar. So we have three foils? Three for 19, is that what we are? Not great, last pack magic here. Let's see if we can turn this around. Let's see if we can get a big pull right here to end it. Battle Wasp win, hit that subscribe button if you haven't already, guys, make it our way to 300. It's gonna be super fun, just like 250 was, hopefully even better. Flipping Feline, Man Man, Poseidon Splash, Anarchist Monk, and Hasamina. Okay, so we got three cards out of 20. Luckily, one of them was a massive one. And here's how we did on our 95. I think we got probably got pretty close with the tokens. But uh, yeah, the, the pull rate's pretty rough there, but they are random in there, which kind of is what makes it fun. It can be amazing, or it can be terrible, or it can be in the middle. Shout out to Tom Fosho, Ernesto Diana, America Doyster, Brandon Cheney, Hextic, Ian Musa, Junior Barding, Robert F., and Changalang. Thank you guys for supporting the channel. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.